So you might have heard, you more than likely have heard of a CPA, but have you ever heard of an EA or an enrolled agent? So in today's video, I'm going to answer a couple of questions that I get. What is an EA and what is the difference between an EA and a CPA? And most importantly, which one should you hire to help with your business? So before I get started, let me introduce myself. My name is Jeanette Andrada. I help private practice owners increase profit margins using tax and accounting strategies. So before we get into the comparison and deciding which one is best for you to hire, let's go ahead and talk about what an enrolled agent is. So you already know what a, a CPA is. It's a certified public accountant, but an enrolled agent is a tax professional that is federally authorized to represent taxpayers before the IRS. So they are individuals with extensive um, tax law knowledge. So you might be wondering, isn't that what a CPA does? Well, there are um, the, the answer is yes and no. There are some key differences between what a CPA could do and an EA could do. So let's talk about those differences. Now, the first um, difference, the main difference, um, is that CPAs have broad accounting knowledge. So they might have knowledge in taxes, assurance, evaluation, uh, financial planning, Whereas enrolled agents, they specialize in tax law. So a CPA might be able to help you audit your financials, um, whereas an enrolled agent is going to specialize more on the tax um, area versus um, providing financials. So another um, key difference is that some CPAs are tax specialists, but not all CPAs um, are tax um, specialists. So I have personally met CPAs that love taxes and they have their own tax firms. However, I've also met other CPAs that don't want anything to do with taxes and they don't even have any working knowledge in taxes. N neither do they care um, to get any working knowledge when it comes to taxes. Now, um, another difference is that CPAs are licensed by state and they need to at most times worry about interstate licensing and working with clients across state borders. Now, enrolled agents are not limited by the state and they do not need authorization to practice in different states. So that might lead you to the question, which should you hire? So um, I personally am an enrolled agent. So I wanted to make this video as unbiased as possible to give you the information you need to make your decision. And honestly, there is no right or wrong answer. Both professionals are very knowledgeable individuals, and they both have to maintain very high ethical standards when it comes to your taxes. So just a rule, um, a rule is that if you're looking for somebody that, um, you know, could help you with issues that you're having with the IRS, or you need help with tax planning, or somebody to prepare your tax returns, then an EA is going to be a solid choice. Like I said, they specialize in tax law. Um, that is all they study. That is all they are, um, you know, that is what their um, designation um, gives them the ability to study, know, the tax law in and out. Now, if you um, need broader accounting assistance, so let's say you are you need to provide audited financials to your bank because of a loan that you took out. It's part of the stipulation with the loan. Then a CPA would be a great choice because they are able to review and they're able to audit and sign off on your financials saying, yes, um, this is all accurate. And, um, and only, like I said, only CPAs could do that. Um, so again, there is no right or wrong answer um, that it just depends on what your needs are, what you're comfortable with. Um, always just like any, hiring anybody else, just looking uh, for somebody that fits your um, vision for your business and somebody that's going to um, be easy to work with and easy or very uh, responsive to your requests and whatnot. Um, so those are the key differences. Again, I am an enrolled agent with the IRS, so I don't want to make this video biased. Um, however, just the key takeaways, if you're looking for somebody specializing in tax law, EAs are a really good choice. If you're looking for somebody that need, um, that is going to be able to help you in broader areas of accounting, a CPA should be your go-to. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to schedule a free 15-minute consultation with me. I'll leave the link down below. Um, I 
offer this consultation to give you um, to give you an idea of what the services we provide, as well as getting to know your business and let you know how we could help you. Um, again, my name is Jeanette Andrada. Thank you so much for watching, and I will talk to you next time.